Just a grown ass kid, so we gon' be fine. What? Cookie soda. We got a smoke and a drink, and I'm gone. Everybody wanna know what I'm living on. I'm on a good vibe. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah. I'm on a good vibe. Crazy ass dude from the get go. Lonely like as a dog in a pet store next to a fish in the get go. Looking at the shop is like, what's the fucking up? It's like, show a girl my track, like, damn, I sound like. Been an amazing family day long weekend. Just want to go back a couple days. This is how it started with this awesome show of Hamilton. We had the idea in late August of this, like, last summer. And then we did a, a smaller version of it. And then now we're doing the whole revival, and we added a floor made out of wood. This is paper, but it's it the, the we crumpled it to, to give it like the old looking effect. Tried to make it look somewhat 17 and 1800s. This is just string. And so much, yeah. Wait, how much practice does it take to do? Like well, hours, hours and hours and hours and hours. Hours. <laughs> what do you mean hours? I think you mean nice. Those cool. Yeah, like you made those. Microphone. Oh, at least this is like official. And then this is our backstage, and actually, it's made out of mattresses. And this is when it comes to be. Oh, it's just a basement. And this is a mic back here that's attached to a speaker behind the set, which is. Oh, so that's what you guys. Is, when we're singing, are... when we're singing, we sing into here, blah, and it comes out of there. Who rigged the lights? I did. Yeah. And so we have it. If you want to like point it in there. Like yeah. Here. So we have these are that turns on the lights, and you can pull this out, and it makes it a spotlight. And you put it back in, and it's full light, and this is blackout. Are these all people you go to school with? Mostly. There's two people that don't go to my school. Will they know what you overcame? Will they know you rewrote the game? The world will never be the same. Oh. What's your name, man? Alexander Hamilton! Yeah! You know, they were so good. It's such an honor to even be sitting at this desk and getting to play with the props. <laughs> Guys, that was so good. That was incredible. Thank you. Jack and Simon. Pleasure to meet you and thank you so much for every time I put a vlog up, liking it. Hey Rob's vlog, it's Noah. Uh, having a sweet family day weekend in Bowmanville, Ontario, and I have a big hockey tournament this weekend. Say no, say in English, say what's up guys? What's up guys? What's up Sharon? What's up Sharon? What's up Ayla? Hi Rob's vlog, we're here in Dallas on President's Day weekend. In Canada you call it Family Day. We're having a great time, we're just driving Eli to school. Hey Eli, do you know how to get there? I don't know, I don't really pay attention. Just drive towards the sun and you'll eventually get there. On or off, you can tune either with the remote unit from your easy chair or use the push button panel in the cabinet. Not the best security system, keeps the animals out at least. Now that chain was definitely put on before we left in the fall. As I said, the security system isn't so great here. That snow kiting looks so cool. I think next winter, I'm gonna try that. Look at that. Be out on the middle of the lake on a beautiful day like today. It's 11 degrees, it's gorgeous. And to be out there kiting, a lot of knots and ropes, but I still wanna give it a shot next year. <laughs> I'm just a country.
country boy. I guess people like you don't like to fool with country people like me. I got the shots that I was looking for. Happy to have the drone back. It really, the gimbal went all wonky. And it was way out there by where those, all those fishing huts are. And I never recommend going on the ice by yourself. I'm kind of not going by myself because I kind of I have you guys with me. I'm just gonna, just gonna go to the kiters. It's a warm ass day. Let's go outside. Just yeah, the lake feels nice and solid. What an unbelievable family day log week. Check this out. I love being on this lake in the winter. Like after spending so much time on in the summer, just to get out, it's so cool. It's a little mushy right there. Yeah, those people have an awesome setup. And a snowman. Maybe hit the grandma ride a bike, putting out my hand like. Good, how was it? Oh. oh yeah, did you catch anything? Well, we caught bird stuff, but uh... Did you have any? Not many keepers. No keepers? Little ones. Where are you guys from? Uh, Keswick. How deep does the uh, ice have to be to go on it? A big. A big? Yeah. Yeah. A foot, right? It's probably good. About a foot, you're good? Well, usually four or five inches is good to walk in. Yeah? Yeah. And how do you break the uh, ice? There you go, this one's a manual one. Right? It takes elbow grease. <laughs> <laughs> how long will it take you to get through this? Not long. 10 seconds. Yeah. Oh, really? And how deep is this ice? About a foot. Oh, great. And yeah. what did you catch today? Just a few perch. perch. Oh, yeah? You got over there? Just two. Oh, that's awesome. And do they fight hard? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, thanks so much. For sure. All right, have a great one. Oh, gosh. What's that? <laughs> How's your day going? Uh, probably about the same as theirs, just <laughs> little guys, you know? <laughs> See you guys, thanks a lot. Are you just out solo? What's we can just put Ditto down. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from Toronto. Toronto, oh, nice. Oh, I'd love to see a catch one. Oh, uh, I think this, if, if, this is small. Oh. Look how small Oh, it is. that's beautiful. Look how small it is. Nice catch, yeah, but if you hold it right close to the screen. Yeah. Like, hold it. Wow, how often do you come out here? Uh, this is probably my fourth or fifth time this year. Um, I'm just gonna put this guy in the live well. For the sure. They'll all go back eventually because uh, they're way too small to keep, but I don't wanna kill them. And I don't wanna put them back down, otherwise they'll steal all my minnows. Oh, that's great. This is the best uh, I've seen in a long time, you know, and it just keeps getting better and better and better, so. Well, hey, thanks so much. You're welcome. You guys are also so nice. They're just sitting out here having the best time. I think we might have animals living under our cottage. Little bastards. Not a bad spot, I guess. Smart little bastards. And yeah, that's way better. Now yeah, that's way more secure. Man, that was awesome getting outside in this beautiful weather on that gorgeous lake and meeting those fantastic fishermen. Man, that's a great run of adjectives. <laughs> but unfortunately tonight we have to come back because it's hockey playoff season about and the GKHL and the NYHL have to pack a lot of games and so they don't give you off the family day weekend. So tonight we got to be at Chesswood Arena. Max's team has a practice and Netter's team has a game and I'd way rather be here than... Actually, we just got hammered by a team we annihilated last time. I think I'd way rather be Grossman's Tavern watching Jeff Healy in 1986. It's like this, I go from being 47 to 48. Oh, look who's waiting for me. Happy birthday. Oh, I'm so lucky. <laughs> <laughs> you 
filming me? No. I gotta go. To the airport to pick up Cassie, my mom, Zach, and Bev. No more spewing of adjectives? No, no more adjectives. All right, come on, beat it. My mom gets shotgun. Okay, see you later at the studio. All right, see you there. There's no place I'd rather be to start off my birthday than picking these guys up.